Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and those of you who know what the hell you're yet. Hop along, Pierre here. We are playing the Dimension Neptunia. Um, so, yeah, I think I mentioned it last time, but I originally said I wasn't going to play this game until I finished Fairy Fencer F, but since you are all so wonderful, so beautiful, and so intelligent, you inform me that it's a long game. So after realizing that, I'm like, oh, well, I can play this intermittently still, which I am. Umio, what's up? Oh, never knew this place existed in the city. What's up with the equipment? Does it work? I too was quite surprised when I discovered it. I never thought I would imagine a facility like this would be left standing in such pristine condition. Umio, is it alright to take a look around? I haven't the slightest about what sort of facility this is, but I'm sure no one is around who would protest. Yay! In that case, I'm gonna dig around the main computer and its server! First, I'll connect the end gear by wire. There. Oh, Gearzy. You're so excitable. How's it, sweet sis of mine? Find anything interesting? Yo! Fear to measure Nep Nep Junior. No way! It's my own younger sibling giving me the cold shoulder. It seems like Gearzy is extremely focused at the moment, so it may be best to keep from disturbing her at the moment. Never! Bug her! Constantly! Oh? Could this possibly be? Hmm? What is it? A discovery? Find something cool? Yes, I thought there was some sort of communication facility, but I think it might actually be used for transportation. A transportation facility, you say? Oh, but the equipment here is only enough for transport between here and the neighboring cities. And, this is a conjecture, but examining device interdimensional travel seems unlikely with this limited science tech here. Oh. That would happen. Sorry, didn't mean to get your hopes up. It's alright, little sis. You're trying. You have to keep searching. Huh? What's that noise? What? It's my angry ringtone. I don't have any reception at all, so... It's hissy! That's be hissy. A call? From who? Um... Oh my goodness! It's Histoire! Neptune, give me a call from Histoire! Really? Wow, she must have a premium cell phone plan to make calls between inventions. Neptune here, the star can be pretty impatient, so I'd pick up the call if I were you. Hello, this is Nepgear. Oh, Nepgear, thank goodness. I've been dying to reach you. Is Neptune with you? Yes, she's right here with me, but you see, we got sucked into another dimension again. Howdy, Esty! It's been a doggo's age. How you been? I'm relieved to hear both of your voices. I've been incredibly worried since your sudden disappearance. I'm sorry, Histy. We tried to contact you many times. There's no reason for you to apologize, Nipgear. After all, you two are in another dimension. Yes. <laughs> um, Nipgear, can you hear me? I just said you're in another dimension. Does that not surprise you? Now we're kind of already on the wall this time. What are you implying? Just confirm that you are in another dimension, yes? I assumed you would be more shocked by this information. <laughs> naive, so very naive, Histy. We already figured that out. We're in another dimension. Over here. So how do you like that? I never would have expected Neptune to anticipate her current situation in this manner. It's only happened 12,000 fucking times! Have you hit <laughs> your head anywhere, perchance? Hey now, Histy. Isn't that kind of cruel? I haven't cracked my melon or anything. And my brains all operate at lightning speeds. Well, the, ma the image of you being lazy has been burned into my mind lately. So I was under the impression that you use your skull for sport. <laughs> ah, so Nepsy acts the same in her world too. Oh, who else is there with you? Your names are Uzume and Umio. They've been helping us quite a bit. Uzume also has to do this PMU here. Just pretend I said words there. I see. And I begin to express my gratitude for you looking after these two. Don't worry about it. I haven't had this much fun for as long as I can remember. It's been a blast having them around. <laughs> yeah. Does people over there suffer from constant brain trauma? What's wrong? Something I said? Oh, no. Nothing at all. I apologize. Remind me of an old acquaintance. Please, pay it no mind. Hmm. That's right. I have not introduced myself. My name is Histoire. I'm currently operating as Planetune's Oracle. Histoire and Planetune, huh? 
getting flashbacks for some reason. Oh, how long have you been up there? <gasps> oh dear, what's the matter? Are you not feeling well? Nah, it's my bad. It's nothing. Just a little tired. Who's a May? Would you like me to speak with her as well? Oh, right. Of course. Greetings, Iswar. This is Umio. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Pleasure's mine, Umio. I apologize for any trouble the girls have caused Neptune in particular. No apologies necessary, Iswar. It's been quite lonesome here for some time now. Oh, it's truly a to hear that. Why does the conversation sound like two parents talking to each other? Yeah, what are we? Kids or something? You are like the daughter to me, Uzume. What? I was your kid, Umio? Mr. Umio, you are the father. What a shocking revelation for Umio, the merman, folks. Uzume, how does it feel to be a nation's first mer CPU? That doesn't mean I can't breathe underwater. And it means I have to eat as much shrimp and crab as I want. All right. We can have a decadent crab hot pot tonight. Woohoo! I simply meant that as a metaphor. It would appear your hands are quite full. I do offer my sympathy, Zumio. Hey, Aswar, are you gonna be able to help us find a way back home? Like you always do? I don't see any possibility here for interdimensional travel. Please rest assured. Why meditating through the end gear and linking transportation terminal from that world to a transfer yeah, is quite possible for me to transfer both of you. Ooh, just as expected of my hissy. So proud of you suddenly becoming an amazing high spec. So amazing high spec. However, this will consequently deplete a large amount of share energy from our world. So please understand that. If we can make it back home, then that's all small stuff. Neptune here will cover for our shares when we get back after all. Only me. Don't be ridiculous. Gaming share energy is the job of description as well. When you return, you believe me, I will have work. I'll have you working like a dog. You for real? Sheesh. You will just stay around on this side of the pond. Don't say that, big sis. Let's go home. I'll help out too, so let's do our best together. Okay, Neptune? You'll really help me out. All right. Yippee! Heavens. Can we spoil her like this, Neptune? So, Isty. We're actually already in a facility that houses a transfer terminal. Is this true, Nepgear? Yes, but this terminal is only calibrated for spatial transfer within this dimension. Could this be com compatible with our application? Yes, as long as it's indeed a transfer terminal. It'll work without any problems. Okay, so I'll use the transfer terminal that you are currently connected to. Guess you two found your ride. Looks like it. I want to get back to my friends and my pudding, but now I'll feel like kind of reluctant about it. Me too. This would be an inevitability. I didn't think I'd be myself. Yeah, be by myself so quickly. Ugh. Ah, that's right. If we leave, she'll be alone again. Well, Nepsy, Gearsy, it's been fun. Only know you for a few days, but it feels like it's been so much longer. You make sure to take care of yourself, Gearsy. Yes, I'm truly sorry. You helped us out so much, but I couldn't figure anything about the destruction of your world. You need not worry, Gearsy. I'll take my time to investigate the rest. Hmm? This is quite strange. It appears I cannot access the terminal over here. Wait, it might be... Histoire, please give me a moment while I check on something. Hmm? I knew it. This terminal's broken. I see. That is a huge problem. I cannot use this terminal, then I'm afraid we may be out of options. And let me fix it. I'll have to examine it to be sure, but I don't think it's too damaged. I think we could still have it work for us. Wow, you're good with machines, but I'm impressed you can fix something like this. Well, she is my awesome little sister after all. By the way, what's your special skill, Nepsy? Me? Well, I have... Oh, wait. Ooh, what should I do, Isume? I don't think I have any marketable skills like Nep Jr. Don't ask me. Please contact me once you have completed the repairs, Nepgear. Leave as long as you are within close proximity to the terminal. And contact you through your end gear. Okay, I understand. Call you as soon as I'm finished. Is there any way we may be of help? For now, I'm gonna try and figure out why the terminal's broken, so you're free to do as you please for now. Ah, there you go, Game Engineer. Don't be shy. I'm more than happy to help. I may not stay up to date with all the games out there, but I sure know my way around to retro consoles. Taking this apart will be a breeze. 
And if I show off how awesome and cool I am here, everyone's going to realize just how capable of a person I really am. That spells nothing but disaster. It's like this problem with affecting Nepsy is <laughs> her weak foot. I may kind of want you to stay put, Neptune. What? Pump the brake, Nepsy. Gears he's got to handle. Let's see if we can find anything around here. Nep gear has left. Okay. Let's head back in, shall we? There we go. Nep gear, how's it looking? Think it's gonna work? Oh, so that's how it's wired. It's pretty strange. I wonder why they have those pots mounted on the boards as opposed to. One hour later. Hey, Gearsy, you done yet? I see. So these broken soldier joints were probably causing you to short out. I wonder where the new sister was supposed to go. Three hours later. <laughs> Can't eat anymore. Wow, this is so crazy! Circuit board has a GC1988 printed on it. An 88 circuit board is so rare. I think the circuit doesn't really serve any purpose for our application, so I can just bypass it and take the board home with me. <laughs> Five hours later. <laughs> Still out cold. No, it's finished. What? Oh, it's finally done. Been waiting. So, will transfer terminal work? Well, I fixed as much as I could. There are two problems. Problems? Yes, the corrosion of one of the core parts of this terminal is really bad. If we want to use the terminal, we need to replace that part. It's able to patch up a lot of the other problems, but I still have a long way to go. You're doing great, Gearsy. What's the other problem? We have no power. A large amount of energy is required to get the terminal running, but there barely seems to be any power left in this building. I see. Both are difficult problems. Nah. You can at least search for the spare part. The city's so fast, I'm sure we can find a substitute for it. And what kind of energy? We can likely find a replacement part quite easily, but I imagine finding a power source is being quite difficult. We can figure that part out later. I can't think of really where we'd even find that right now. Yep, we might find a solution while we're looking for the part. Exactly. That being said, let's go look for it. Nepgear is back. Huzzah! Alright, so still, still talking. Can't find anything. I could have sworn I saw something that looked similar. Let's take a break for lunch and search after. I'm starving. I like that idea. What should we do for lunch? I know. Let's have some pudding. It is around that time now that you mention it. Is there anything you're craving, Yuzume? Pudding. Nepsy? Gotta be meat. How can you have pudding if you don't eat your meat? Ouch. That actually hurt to say. Neptune? Is that, how does meat sound? Meat's good too. But I'd still like to propose having some super sugar treats as a dual lunchtime snack time meal. Ah, oh, I guess sweets sound good too. When you talk about sweets, it's gotta be crepes. Uzume would love to have a strawberry chocolate banana crepe with like a ton of whipped cream. The balance between tangy, slightly sour strawberry and the sweet chocolate is super yum. It's the best. Oh, even if we had the ingredients, it'd be totally awesome if we had that. Oh. Oops. <clears throat> well, you know, it's good enough. I'm not really that hungry anyway. Whatever is clever, Nipsy. Dear me, there's no reason to even cover it up at this point. Yes, we all know. Then it's decided. We'll have crepes for lunch. Let's search around for any leftover ingredients. There's a building nearby that looks like it used to house a market. Let's check it out. It was amazed really cute when she tries acting all tough. It's so adorable. I'd really like to take her to the crepe shop and plan up Tower Street someday. More! More talking! Should I be doing anything in between? Like, I don't know why that thought just occurred to me, but... This seems like the type of stuff they give us to do once we get tired of, you know, doing dungeon shit. 
until I hear otherwise. Ah, yes, cracked sky. Oh, this terminal might be... I knew it! So we can get online. I will find something. Ah, here it is. What terrible things are you gonna find? Month? Day. We can't stop... Rampaging. At this rate, fall to ruins. I decided to search for a way to stop a rampage. Month day. I feel like I'm seeing a... And yet another has perished. How can I possibly stop it? Month day. Return to normal. She remembered what she had done. Asked me to... Wow, 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 wow. Four letter word. Nothing fits in there that's good. First, I jumped to the logical conclusion of the F word, but then killed also fits in there. I mean, I get the meaning, but at the same time, I sort of don't. What are you looking at? Oh yeah, Uzume has five letters. Oh, Uzume, collecting the intel, what happened here in your world? And wait, didn't I mention this before? Oh right, my bad. So, how's that going? I found several records, but all the data I found has been incredibly disjointed. Can make heads or tails of what I've read. What's your end goal here, Nev Gearsy? So want to know the truth. I want to know what heck this world was like and why it's been destroyed. It's just speculation, but I feel like the reason the station fell into ruin is written here in these records. There might not be much I can actually do with the information once I uncover it, but even so, it's just good to know. I see. Well, let me tell you right ahead. I am the problem. I probably fucked everything up. Maybe you'll be the one to release me from this prison, Gearsy. Prison? I've tried so many times to escape. Every attempt has been in vain. That blue sky feels so nostalgic. It might be what I just thought I needed. Who's a May? Whoops! Start talking about weird things. Forget it. I'll catch up with you later. So does she actually remember anything? Or is she getting her memory back in little snippets? Prison, huh? This is really painful for Uzume to be in this world. Hey, Gearsy! Wake up, Gearsy! Hmm? Why are you here, Uzume? I thought you just walked away. Man, still half asleep? Came over here saying that there might be a terminal connected to the web, and didn't come back, so I came to pick you up. Oh, yes. Guess that was what happened. Find anything? Oh, I did. I was able to find this record. Let me see. Month, day. You can't stop Uzume's rampaging powers. At this rate, the world will fall to ruins. I decided to search for a way to stop her rampage. Month day. I feel like I'm seeing a nightmare. And another city has perished. How can I possibly stop it? Month day. Who's may return to normal? She remembered what she had done. Asked me to kill her. So yeah. K word was right. What the hell is this? I don't get it at all. Gearsy, this makes sense to you. Huh? I like to look different from before. I see the data properly. Hey, that half asleep? No, that was probably our foire fucking around with you. Hey, Napsy! Found this in the pile of rubble. Here you go. Whoa, it's a dead copy of Z Boys. You know it? Know it? Super famous title where the makers of the original pen hidden message that easily weeds out fake ones. They're pretty knowledgeable when it comes to games, huh, Napsy? Over here, it's a Benta. If you peel off this crappy logo sticker, see? Told you, Zeka, the real manufacturer behind this thing. I should show this to Nep Junior too. Hey, Nep Junior, found something rare. Hey, Nep Junior. This man Neptune seem to be having so much fun. This will all end soon. It won't it? Is it really okay for us to leave this man and go back home? Neptune and I both have to return. We have people waiting on us. It's fine. I wonder what's wrong. Did you not hear me? Try yelling louder. No, really. Is there anything I can do to, you know, progress through this land? Wait, 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 wait. City one, city two, city three, city four, city five. So, what if this is a world that had five CPs in it? Maybe one was artificially created for whatever reason. Yes, yes, Nip. I hear ya. I'll get on with it.
Mm. Hey, Nutsy. This gears are acting a little weird lately. You notice, too, eh? That gear hasn't hurt his soul, so something's wrong. So pretty much written all over her face. She's the exact opposite of you, huh? Are you trying to apply that I'm not earnest? Yep. <laughs> Why, you little brah? I want to defend myself, but I'm self-aware enough to know that you're right. Why don't we talk to Nepgear? See what she's worrying about. Neptune here. Have a sec. Oh, Neptune. Does it even matter? He's going to be down in the dumps lately. So Uzume and I were getting concerned. Something's troubling you. We'll be glad to listen. We're here for you. Troubles, huh? I'm sorry, I made you both worry. It's okay. Oh, I'm fine. I know you better than anyone, Nepgear. You don't look fine at all. Yeah, Gearsy, you have a pretty awful look on your face right now. Do I? Should I go wash my face over there for a bit? Completely avoided the question. Mm. She ran away, still no clue about what's upsetting her. I guess it's, it's difficult for her to talk about whatever is bumming her out so much. What could it be? Hmm, no idea. Now let's get her something as present to cheer her up. You know what to get, right? Something that Nep Jr. would love, hmm? Big hardware geek, so... Be great if we could find something amazing enough to blow away all her worries. For example... Hmm. There's a giant robot equipped with enough power to destroy all civilization. She'd definitely be delighted. <laughs> Even if that was simply an example, I'd rather stay away from something so dangerous. Who's the mate? Holy thing, that something cute would be better than a giant robot. Even though I've never seen it, I'm sure Gearsu's room is full of super cute plushies. I bet she's going to each and every one a proper name, and at night she sleeps while cuddling her favorite one. Then she'll come crawling into Nepsi's bed, teary eyes, saying that she can't sleep without her favorite plushie. Isn't it just the most moe? <laughs> I'm sure it is, so. Uh. Uh. But yeah, I think those giant robots would be pretty badass too, Gearsy. Gearsy would probably dig it too, I guess. Robots are just the coolest after all. They're just so romantic. Goodness gracious, Izume. They're always like this. Never seen such a thing, however. Although if one truly did exist, it'd be disturbing to have around. Games are the best answer at a time like this. No matter how troubled you are, playing games together make all your worries fly away. Experience over material goods, I see. It's quite like you, and a good suggestion. I can get behind that too. Let's stop looking for parts a little and go have some fun at the arcade. You guys have a functioning arcade? And did you not, did you not, did you not invite Netgear? How dare you? Neptune, where are we going? Didn't we come here before? We're taking a break from searching for now. Take a breather at the arcade. Arcade? We have to find that part. We need to loosen up, Gearsy. We need to feed the giant, so no one's gonna complain if we kick it for a little bit. Right, Nepsy? Nah, we're good. If anybody has any complaints, I'll just nip them up. So yeah, about the arcade, hmm? It was nice to be super happy if they had crane games with cute plushies. And while you go to an arcade, you definitely gotta hit up the photo booths. Let's take cute pictures together, Gearsy. Okay. Ooh. Oh man. Came all the way to the arcade, but all the cabinets are broken. It's no use, they won't even turn on. But I'll bust it up. There's not much we can do here. Any other arcades? Hmm. Honestly, I haven't seen enough of the city to really know for sure. Romeo, do you know of any arcade spots? Most arcades in this area are similar in states. In fact, most of all the places I'm aware of, this is the best in condition. Classic Umio, so knowledgeable. I've investigated most every corner of the city in search of share person to draw. Going to the neighboring town might be what you guys might want to do, I think. Whoa! Thanks! Why, if it isn't Baby Bug, it's been a while. What a coinky dink you're here. And what a coincidence that this happens to not gross you out anymore. I happened to spot you all with Miss Usame and ran over here as fast as I could. Good little fried shrimp. Especially enough to see you, baby bug. It's good to see you. So you mentioned the neighboring town. Is there an arcade there? Yeah, some of our friends are living. So that's all I needed to hear. Let's head over, everyone. Might be able to find some parts of the transfer terminal. 
something! We got to something! Huzzah! I did a thing. How long get to make this bulky bracelet? Maybe if I equipped it, my stats won't go up. Who's the bug? It's a power bracelet, right? Let me see. Hmm? Oh! Now that I recall, there are some boxes we couldn't break before. I feel like we can do something about those, Neptune. What do you mean by feel? Teach me, Histy! You'll know, sometimes encounter obstacles in dungeons. These are known as destructible objects. You destroy them when you possess the power bracelet. When you break destructible objects, you can maintain random items. Try to destroy those where you can. As the game progresses, you might obtain an item that's even more powerful than the power bracelet. The power gauntlet? Power glove? I don't know. Alright, let's head into this dungeon. Club Zika. And what do we have? Please be a voice. Please be voiced. Ooh, arcade. Hey, baby bug. This is pretty different from what we were talking about. This is strange. The hell's crests have been living here. Hey! Oh, crest! What's going on? Is everyone okay? It's been rough. Dangerous monsters started living here just a little while ago. Don't worry, everyone's safe. Thank goodness. Alright, we deal with. Is it okay to ask for your help, Miss Kuzume? I'm not perfect, but I'm a CPU. In situations like this, I consider it my duty to step in. You say the monsters just settled here. Were you talking about the ones outside, right? Those weaklings are no match for me. I'll get the job done in style, so just watch. Thank you so much. It's all good. We had some games here, so we came to play. Ain't nothing stopping us now. So that's why you and your friends came, Kuzume. Play some games. Truly as I stand here. So once we defeat the monsters, can you show us the best game that's here? Of course! Gotta be having fun, anyway. Yes, yes! So here a job to kick ass first, then... ...to... ...you know, just do whatever the fuck we want. Alright, save generator, next event. We know what's going on. What's gonna be going on soon. That should do it. You're running around too fast, Uzume! I'm all tuckered out! Oh, Nepsy, you gotta shape up if you, this much running will exhaust ya. Oh, you're just too energetic. Right, Nipgear? Huh? I actually feel okay with this much movement. Betrayal! No, that's what video games does to you, Nepgear. Ugh, Neptune. My tongue doesn't want to obey me right now. Well, Nepsy, you've been doing... Lately is beating... Well, Nepsy, all you've been doing lately is eating a bunch of pudding and rolling around. And that's... Bad. Thank you, Miss Yuzume. On behalf of my tribe, we're very grateful. No, seriously, no problem. You need to thank me. You did find me a bunch of share crystals, after all. We gotta help each other out. This is... Share energy from the Hell's Crest. Alright, Yuzume. Got some shares here, too. It's like you're a heroine in a dating sim, where the more you raise your friendship with monsters, the more shares you get. <laughs> yep. Starting to see a little bit of flashback. Aren't you, Uzume? Uzume! Hey! Uzume! Go right, Uzume! Yeah, alright. I got so worked up by getting hungry and got just a little dizzy. Oh, I see. Here I was all worried. Jeez, sure know how to worry people. My bad. Here, take this. It's just pudding, right? It's not your average everyday pudding. It's 50% kindness, 50% divine protection. 100% pretty cool. The CPU of Planet has been warming in her pocket since morning. <laughs> right. That's why it's lukewarm. Now then, could you guide us to where the arcade cabinets are located? They're over there. Please follow me. Or, you know, there's just strewn throughout. Got away. What a quick bastard. Nap Junior, went that way. Go get it. Yes, it's me. I did it, Neptune! I got the headshot! You really are good at this. I'm shocked you get MVP twice in a row. Am I? Here you go again, being all humble and stuff. You're my pride little sis, so that's more confidence. I'm gonna get MVP in the next stage and stuff, so watch out. Keep dreaming. I'm the one who'll be crowned MVP. Who's made it look like she's having so much fun? This might be the first time I've seen her in such high spirits. She'd been concerned with nothing but the giant until now. It's been a long while for me as well. 
The face truly really does suit her. Hey, Neptune here. Is there any sort of trick to winning at this? If there is, can you teach me only me the street me? Um, you see, when you fire, you should squeeze your arms to yourself and aim. That way, the side won't shake. Hey, that isn't fair. Keep those secrets. You better tell me the truth. Of course. And please come over here and now. Oh. Hmm? What's up, Gearsy? That's right. That's it. It's that simple. I didn't figure out something like this sooner. What we have to do is solve everything in this world before heading back to our world. Brilliant. I, 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 I see why she's the genius now. Clearly, all the brains between the sister belongs to her. Ugh, my baby's getting this pretty fast. And games really are fun when you play them with others. It's always as fun. I want to come here every day with you two. I agree. We should definitely do this again sometime. It looks like our plan worked. She really is your sister. Her mood gets better from playing games. Huh? What do you mean? What the hell? Who's a man? Over there. There's something in the back. Huh? Soul's hiding the whole time. Soul had an equipment. I think it's military grade. She's just a guess by looking at the frame it's using, but its AI is probably a few decades old. That's only a guess based on what I've seen in our world. We have a special programmer armament with it, so please be careful. Yep, gear's looking like she's back to normal. Although, I don't know why I just skipped that. But I can vouch for how strong she is when she gets riled. Enough chit chat. Let's scrap this heap of junk already. Yes, ma'am. Everyone, please lend me your strength. Let's see. Can I do it in one single round of these three? Yeah. If yep. My turn. No. Let's see. De -de -de. Yeah. You're going down. No. Oh, it's got a few different lines of health. Gotcha. You know, there's just nothing like a good old fashioned <laughs> beaten line. Honestly, just quarter them and just start beating the shadow of them. A lot of things will work in your favor if you do that. Guarantee you. And you gonna die here soon, sucker. Jersey, do it! Yay! But me thinks that was triggered by Uzume. She was the target. But then again, that's probably not that hard to figure out either. So can't really take much credit. And all three, huzzah! Rapid rush. Whew, that thing was all show. Uh, Neptune, it would be okay if I disassembled this robot. Oh, she got games and her giant robot. Everything's coming up Nep gear. Sure, but don't make a mess. Okay, I promise. Where should I start taking it apart? From the chest? Move it ahead. Starting from the feet, working my way up sounds pretty intuitive too. It's a trap if the first thing that she thinks about after a killing machine is taking it apart like some toy model. Can't be helped. That gear loves to tinker. It's in her blood. Oh! Hmm? What's wrong? Did you just magically find the piece that you were looking for? Just found a replacement for that broken terminal part. Are you serious? I think you can fix the transfer terminal. Woohoo! We did it! I might make another lucky find. I'll try taking apart some other places. Came to have fun, but it would seem like we've found quite the windfall. Say that again. Here's he cheered up too. It's a good thing we came here. And we've done something this episode. Huzzah! And I am going to leave it at that because God knows how many more talking sequences are out next. So thank you everybody for watching. If you have anything you want to say, make some noise on the comments below. And thank you for staying weird. <laughs>